Soljan, beyond yeah. the presidential statements, we had reports in the past about uh, the, the killings uh, in the conduct of the war being incentivized. Binibigyan daw ng mga reward yung mga police na nakakapatay, binigyan sila ng quota. Was there ever any effort to, to, to verify these reports or to investigate? Uh, well, uh, none that I know of. Uh, pero uh, siguro uh, in the course of uh, uh, in the course of investigating itong mga uh, na identify na may active participation, those who were on the ground, no, yun yung inintay namin na uh, in their defense ay meron silang sa sabihin na mga ganyang classing information. So we are also hoping na uh, we'll get leads from those na initially ay ini-investigahan. So it builds up upon itself eh. Yung mga nakukuha mong ebidensya from some people uh, will become the building blocks, no? so to speak, of evidence against other people naman, no? maybe their superiors, etc., etc. So we're in that process. Kaya lamang, yun niya ay uh, parang naiinip sa atin ang ICC. Kaya they, they want to take over na at dumiretso na kagad sila instead na ang iniimbestigahan nila ay yung mga involved sa actual, sa actual na killing, ay eh, dinderetso na kagad sila doon sa, let's say, colonel or general kahit na walang uh, clear involvement doon sa incident na nangyari on the ground. So, that's what they want to do. But that's not how we do uh, things here. So, maybe who knows that in the future, ay merong uh, ganung gagawing steps ng ating investigative uh, agencies. We don't know that yet. We have just uh, actually begun itong long process of investigation. But who knows if something may come up in the future na ganyan ang magiging uh, uh, method ng investigation. Maybe the creation of, of an independent commission may actually solve that kind of uh, concern na bakit, in bakit yung mabababa lamang ang investigahan. So uh, what I'm saying is, dapat bigyan tayo ng opportunity ng ICC. Huwag yung pangunahan tayo. Kasi yan naman po pwede natin gawin eh. Hindi naman tayo time-bound. Pwede naman natin gawin yan anytime. Depende sa magiging decision ng ating mga authorities. Sir, balikan ko lang yung sinabi niyo po. I, I, uh, uh, I, I just want to make sure that I heard it right. Are, are you saying that, uh, are you proposing a creation of an independent commission to, to look into uh, these issues? Um... Uh, you know, Ed, um, that had been uh, proposed by uh, some people um, much, much earlier. In fact, I also entertained that idea. Mm -hmm. But uh, I guess uh, it's a matter for um, uh, higher-ups to make a decision on something like that. Yeah, yes, sir. Certainly, sir. But, but sir, uh, at least from your point of view, sir, uh, is it something that uh, you think is a good idea? Uh, I mean, I, I think it's interesting that you bring it up, eh? Because, you know, uh, uh, otherwise, parang we're just floating around and uh, and, uh, and uh, waiting for things to happen at, or for things to fall in place. So, so uh, more or less, what, what do you have in mind? Uh, who would be appointing the members of the commission, if at all? <laughs> well, that's really jumping the gun, no? Uh, I mean, the idea <laughs> itself <laughs> must be sold. <laughs> the idea itself must be accepted before we even think about who should comprise this independent commission. But it's an idea worth uh, looking into.